put it away before the video. <laughs> hey, everybody, look what he was eating. He doesn't care about his health. Not that the nobody should give a fuck about that. My God, these zombies are so fat. I'm like, you know how many other YouTubers are really, really <laughs> big? <laughs> What's up, guys? It's me, Spidey. And I am Kisame Unlimited. And I'm here doing another Could This Be Meta. No, you're not. <laughs> Get out of here. So, well, what's the one that you're going to do? Because let me do it. Cause... No, you can't do this but one. They I'm love doing... me. I'm Spidey. <laughs> you're not, you're hey, never... you. <laughs> Eat more food, you fat fuck. <laughs> <laughs> hey, guys, it's the six paths of stupidity. <laughs> six paths of diabetes. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, it's expensive diabetes. <laughs> you got the muffins, you got the cookies, <laughs> you got the Dorito bags, and then you Sony got that, Pops. that Baskin Robbins <laughs> ice cream. Doing Could This Be Meta, if you don't know what Could This Be Meta is, Could This Be Meta is a segment where we take a, um, an old art stripe or something recent or maybe a card that somebody's commented and then we'll create five fantasy support cards, either me or Kisame, we'll create these five fantasy support cards and then we will discuss with this support card, will this stuff be good, would it be garbage, is it broken, is all hell? My frogs were amazing! <laughs> Well, he did frogs, and now I'm doing something highly requested. As you see from the title of the video, I'm tackling the Venom monsters. And it's very funny. I looked up the Venom cards. I, I made a like I made a practice like they need like a total fucking recall. No, they don't. No, they don't. Kinda this do. is this is the funniest shit in the world to me. Before we get to the sport, I'm gonna say before I did this, I, I was very foreign to this archetype. So I made like, oh, let me make a um, let me try to just make a test deck of it. Let me just see what Bro, they do. Bro, venoms are so me, No, let me. No, I wasn't gonna do that. <laughs> I didn't do it with the shit. I just made just to like look at it, just to see what 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 was the strengths and what was his weaknesses. And I made it that there's a lot of support for reptile monsters now. There's a lot. You know what I'm saying? There's a lot of support for them. They have a lot of basic stuff. They they send stuff from the deck to the graveyard. They have their little bit of speed. They have a win condition. The only problem is the monsters are, themselves are very slow because they can activate their effects. But if they activate their effects, they can't attack the same turn that they activate their effects. Yeah. But then they also one of the, to me the biggest strength was in their field spell card, which makes the opponent's monsters lose attack points. And then once they hit zero, the monster is just destroyed. Three monsters, one spell, one trap. Mm. I'm not. I don't know. I'm always so standard. Two monsters, two spells, one trap. I've always been doing that. I like to switch it up sometimes, but I need you to move to the side as okay. I will present these cards. <clears throat> the first card I made for them is called Venom Gaboon, which is the name of a, a different type of snake. All these cards are named after snakes. I did my Clever. research. <laughs> I did my You'll research. You'll just have Kisame's hand. Clever. <laughs> Seven, level four, 1,700 attack points, zero defense points. Exactly. Oh, my God. <laughs> Did you I already just hear Mask Chameleon plays? Yes. Oh, and King of the Feral Limbs plays? King of the Drop. Feral Limbs, Mask... King of the Feral Limbs, Mask fucking Chameleon, got and Kage Tokabe. King of the Feral Babies. I like it. I'm gonna kind of scooch back over here. If this card is sent to the graveyard, special summon one level four Venom Monster from your deck. Very staple. Almost like a, a, a numeral manga, but since there's so many different ways where you can send mo Venom cards from the deck with their spell card, there's like, I just want to say, oh, sent to the graveyard, like almost like a Burning Abyss type of ability. You get to bring out another one. Except itself. The another card I made for them is called Venom Anaconda. My Anaconda don't. <laughs> level four, 1500 attack points, 900 defense points. I didn't give none of them crazy stats. Um, <laughs> once per turn, you can target one monster with venom counters on it. Okay. Destroy the target. So you can just boom pop monsters. That's, pretty, that's a three. Mm -hmm. If this card declares an attack against a monster with a venom counter on it, your opponent can activate. Can your opponent cannot activate any card effects until the end of the damage step. So it's like you can either pop the monster or you can attack it and then. Nothing. The opponent well, can't so respond far, to it. So far, you get an A for that one. The mm -hmm. first one, eh. This one, pretty good. The next Wait, what level? Four. All of these are level four. <laughs> uh, what, what defense? Um, 900. Yeah, I know. <laughs> next card I made for them is called Black Venom Mamba. Like That's the Black a monster? Mamba. Yes, a monster. Okay. 1,200 attack points, 1,200 defense points. Them same stats, though. Mm -hmm. You know, I could have had just 2,400 attack points and zero defense. No, no. Because the, the bigger monsters have zero, so you can just kind of swoop them back up. This ability is, you can draw one card for every Venom counter on your opponent monster's side of the field. 
you can discard this card from your hand and place one Venom counter on each face of monster your opponent controls. You can only activate can I hear one that of these one effects. Effect again? Can I hit the first effect again? The first effect is you can draw one card for each Venom counter on for each Venom counter that you have on your opponent's side of the field. You draw one card. Now picture this as a sock puppet <laughs> <laughs> called Venom Reserve. The, the spell and trap card kind of go hand in hand. They both continuous trap cards. Well, once you continue track card, once you continue your spell card. The card Venom Reserve, its ability, each time a monster with a Venom counter, if it has you know, Venom counters or a counter, is destroyed, add one Venom counter to this card. Max five. If this card has five Venom counters on it, your opponent can activate, your opponent cannot activate any set spell or trap cards. If this card is destroyed by your opponent's card effect, with, and this card has five Venom counters on it, you can special summon one Venom Magania, the deity of the poisonous stakes, regardless of the summoning conditions, and place one Hyper Venom counter on it already. I don't know what the fuck you're doing. I'm looking at you for a reaction <laughs> while I'm a snake! <laughs> <laughs> the last card I made for them is called Toxic Shock Syndrome. And this is a spell card. Continuous spell card. Okay. Each time a Venom card is sent to the graveyard, place one Venom counter on this card. Maximum six. You can only activate one of these effects per turn. If you you can remove two counters from it, from anywhere on the field, from anywhere on the field, from itself or from monsters or whatever, special summon one Venom monster from your deck or graveyard. Which does not include the level 6 one or the level 8 one, because, you know, just the basic ones plus the ones I made for them. Very simple, remove two, very easy to do. Next one, remove Three counters, Venom counters, negate all card effects on your opponent's side of the field for the rest of the turn. Okay. So it's like a trap summon you. Boom. Even Next one. Remove five counters, Venom counters from this card. Your opponent cannot draw or add cards from their deck during their next turn. That's crazy. Do you have to get rid of all your counters to do well, it? just five. So you still get left with one. Oh, I is, like that card. That card's good. It's unfair, but no, I just wanted to. They do, need it. They, I they wanted no, to do something. No I wanted them to do something like I want. I want you to be paralyzed. So I wanted to kind of make the effect of like, oh, once you activate it, they can't do anything until the end of their next turn. I kind of the only thing I wish was I kind of wish that your spell your spell trap is really good. I just wish that your monsters had a little bit more bang to the buck. I just wish that they were like, no. I wanted to, but they're kind of more battle based with the whole Venom. But it, but it seems a little language. weird because it would be so weird because it's like you're kind of trying to make them bounce with the other ones. Yeah. You can't just have these are the new Venoms because yeah. nobody would want to use the old ones. Yeah. So I'm trying to meet you halfway. So <laughs> I'll accept you for what you said and I'll accept them. I'm like, all right. And they have, good job they on have a lot of stuff already. And when you think about it, mixing them with Mask Chameleon, Kage to Kage, and King of the Feral Lips, that's a lot of crazy because King of the Feral Lips can search out fucking um venom agnia hopefully you guys liked it and you guys enjoyed like it like the video like the video video gaga -ga cowboy those like point life life points why don't you give away packs anymore you don't care about your subscribers you should go away i feel like that i keep fucking up on words nigger <laughs> <laughs> Comments I'm agreeing with, like, oh, so fucking up. And I'm like, yeah, I'm on my, I'm not on my shit. I'm fucking up. You're right, guy. Like, you're right, mean comment person. <laughs> well, what did I do to deserve that one? Um, <sighs> like the video, please. And if you like, you see us continue. Make more cookies be better. Comment down below any um suggestions that aren't nigger related. <laughs> like, It'd be like Nick go. <laughs> Oh god. Alright, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you enjoyed his Venom cards and you have your opinions on them or you would like to say your opinions of new Venom cards and you would want to make them or your ideas, leave them in the description below. And we'll, we won't Comments leave. below. I said description. Yeah. Comments Comment, below. subscribe, like all the things and the words that are coming out of my face. Bye. Right, have a good day.